So when did you first get a melodica? I got the melodica when I was in high school, graduating to go to Juilliard. And then I played it everywhere I went. I played it around the halls at Juilliard. The teachers got mad at me. I played it in the subway all the time when I was going between classes and stuff like that. And then I played it on the street and people started to get to know me around New York for it. So that's how I really learned how to play it, just carrying it everywhere I went. Talk about how it works. What's well, interesting because I call it the harmonica board because to me it's like a harmonica and a keyboard put together. You got this sound that you can get out of it, that's the harmonica. You can get that kind of sound like the harp. Then you can also get this kind of gypsy sound, you know, it's almost Parisian or something too. You know, the And when you do that, are you doing tongue? tongue yes, work or that's tongue, triple tongue. Uh, and then you have the buzz, you know, in the throat that you can get this uh, very growl oriented sound, almost like a saxophone. So it, it has a lot of character, you know. Does it bug you that you can only use one hand on it? No, it, it's not as a piano is to me a percussion instrument that you sit down and you play this to me is not a piano it's more of a horn it has a voice that's powered by your air and it's distinct in the sound world that it creates in the rhythm section the piano is kind of a bass foundational instrument this to me is a melodic instrument so i i, I play it completely different i think differently when i'm playing it Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. <laughs>